Les prometimos actividades extremas y en este destino de Copa Airlines, aparte de volar en avión o helicóptero, se vuela sobre una tabla. Hoy vamos a hacer flyboard. Ah, ¿Qué es flyboard? A flyboard is a type of water jetpack hoverboard attached to a personal watercraft which supplies propulsion to drive the flyboard. Flyboard. Bienvenido. Es welcome o oh, bienvenido. Sorry? Bienvenido. 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 Bien. Bien. Eh, algo por el estilo. Bear, ¿es tu nombre? Bear. Bear. Yeah. Okay. Welcome Bear to the TV show. This is the name of the TV show. A thousand kilometers from the sea or a mil kilómetros del mar. It's the um, geographic situation of our country, Paraguay. It's a rented bad land. We don't have oceans. We don't have ocean. So this sport, it's really, really rare for us. Mm -hmm. What kind of sport is this? It's a sport that's uh, really different than all the other board sport experience. Uh, you can do a lot of water sports like wakeboarding, uh, skiing on the water, but flyboarding is totally different because it's uh, you go up. With uh, wakeboarding, skiing, you go forward. And with flyboarding, you're standing up. If this is the board, the board will push you up. Okay. So it's totally different. I prefer it more than wakeboarding or all the other, uh, uh, all the other water sports because it's much easier. It's easy and nice, and we can build the pressure slowly it's easier. up. Because if you do wakeboarding, you get to pull out. With flyboarding, we just slowly give you the pressure. So it's really nice and easy. How long do you practice? Uh, do you been practice this sport? I practice the sport now for one year, and the sport is. And uh, developed uh, four years ago, and we work now on Curacao for almost three years. Okay, the first experience for, for me. Uh, this is uh, what's the name? Flyboard for dummies. I am the yeah. dummy. You know that. And uh, just in five steps, give me a lesson. Five steps. We we'll always start uh, to know how you steer because if you lay down in the water, you get from us a vest and a helmet. Instructor on jet ski is steerless. So you go, all the power goes to the board and you go forward, you pull me with you. So you have to know how to steer. For the rest, the basics is that you stand straight in the water. If your body position is straight, it will go straight up. If you bend too much, like wakeboarding, okay. so, uh, in the water, you will fall always. And for the rest, it's just keep on your balance, keep on recovering. The center Everything of gravity. On your foot position. How about the knees? The knees, just bend them a little bit. Like you stand on the ground, you stand on the board. Everything depends on your foot position. Because uh, the board is connected to the jet ski, jet ski by a hose. If you give the power, they come a high pressure via the hose to the board, out the exhaust pipes, down. So if your foot position is flat, the exhaust pipes are pointing down so the power goes up. Okay. We have people who are standing too much on their toes or too much on their heels. It's fun for us because if we give the power, it will go, go up. Always fall backwards, always okay. fall forward. Okay. But that's no problem, that's always in the beginning. But you have to feel where your balance is. But that's that's about everything. We do little kids from eight years old to old people uh, from around seven. Okay. Uh, how much how much time do you think that most people are about ten to fifteen minutes. Ten oh. people uh, ten minutes and if it's not going well fifty minutes. Okay. But the most people are standing in ten minutes. Okay. We have people who are standing straight the first time, we have people standing in five minutes, and after fifty minutes the most people stand. Okay. Mm -hmm. 